Hey, so a student needs help in Seesaw, and obviously you're not there to help them because we're distance learning. How can I help them, and how can they ask for help? Check this out. So, in your guys' Seesaw, there's actually a comments button right here. So right now I am sample student, and I don't get what to do on this. So I click comment, and if a kid can type it, he can type it. But if he's in kindergarten and he can't type, then he can record and watch this. Hey, Mr. Green, it's me, Eliza. I can't figure out what to do on this thing. Help me, help me, help me. All right. It's processing, it uploads. And then when you're the teacher and you click on there, you start looking at their work. Oh, I got to, he's got to hit the green button. Okay, so that's the student. Then as the teacher, here I am, I'm the teacher. I look at my journals, I look at Elijah, and I notice that Elijah has a comment here. I can play it. Hey, Mr. Green, it's me, Elijah. I can't figure out what to do on this. All right, we don't need to listen to that whole awesome voice right there. So, <laughs> so then you can comment back to them, or you can, you know, call them when they get help or say, Hey, I'll help you figure out some way of helping them and you can reassign it. Okay. So you could even technically make a video and send it just to them on their seesaw. So which is pretty cool, but that's how you can get feedback from them. And then you can send them feedback somehow. All right, boys and girls, that is how kids can give you feedback. And that's important for you to show them eventually on a zoom or something that they, if they need help, they can click on that. I do want to say one thing about that too. My daughter used Seesaw last year, and there's, you know how there's like different pages? Well, one time my daughter didn't know there was a whole bunch of pages. She only did one page, and her teacher actually wrote her message saying that, like, hey, Hazel, you have, you only did one page. You got, there was 10 pages to do. And then Hazel's like, oh, no. So she went back, hit edit, and did the rest of the pages. So sometimes it's not just they need help. Sometimes it's the feedback, like, hey, you forgot to do something, all right? So, and you can resubmit it to them. Right, thank you guys.